Is that what we're gonna discover? Murderers and all that good stuff. So how old was George at this time? I wonder that. Over there. And then he's just gonna slaughter all of them. I gotta do this, right? Okay, episode six, Zach Morgan. What? Hey there! Did I kill? I didn't even hit him! There we go. They're dead. Who else? Where do they want me to go? Where do y'all want me to go? Oh, over here? What's over here? Wait, don't tell me I gotta walk all that entire fucking distance. Well, it shouldn't be that far, I don't think. Uh-oh, here's some people that are gonna die. Guess what? You're next. Goodbye. Oh, and I can't... Uh, okay, it's a dead end back here. I obviously... They want me to obviously stay on the fucking street. Maybe I didn't want to do that. Maybe I wanted to try to... Just okay if they want me to go that way. How come I can't go that way? If you want me to go that way, why are you block it? Why are you making me go a long way around? Okay, obviously something got fucked up over here. I'm gonna guess there's supposed to be a tree right here, but it's not appearing. It's floating fire. Okay, so I don't even need to bother with anybody, I can just skip everybody. Make a run for the destination, I think. That's what it appears to be. Through here. Alright, what's it gonna be, guys? Since y'all freaking out over here, and I'm the most sane one here at this point. And you're not gonna... Oh, wait. Is there a way... No. Dead end. So I have to continue going all the way around. Five. What's five? What's happening with five? Come on, I want to destroy these. Hey, get out of the way. Okay, good. I can just skip y'all. Y'all really dragging this shit out, ain't you? What's it, what, okay, is there... I can't even look at the fucking map. Okay, my guess is they want me to go th down this way, so... Really, it's just like, better off to stay on the fucking street, I guess. Yep, here we go. I was wondering how far away we were from this road to get up here. So apparently it seems like this town was a military experiment um, and they wanted to see what that gas did to everybody I guess. Now they know, especially, well I mean they, they made note of it and made it very clear that there was a cover up of the events that happened here. Um, so... Uh, my guess is that the raincoat killer is going to be killed. Like, we're gonna get up here and encounter the military guys, and since I have an axe and they might have- they should have guns, they'll shoot me down and then be like, okay, we're done here, we already conducted our experiment, we got all the information and stuff we needed, so we're gonna get the fuck out of here. That's my guess. Well, I wonder, I wonder, okay, if George and, 
Um. No, wait. This this took place way before George and Emily. You know, Emily rejecting George. So I don't know. We'll see. I don't know. George could have already been born at this point, so I don't know. We're gonna make our way in there. We're like zombies now at this point. Do you have to kill them all? I might have to kill them all. Okay, what's that supposed to be? The time. Do I have to kill them all or could I just run by them? Fuck y'all, I'm just gonna run away. Okay, so now it's like a timed event where I gotta make my way over here. I don't know, so they all just seem like zombies more than anything at this point, I guess. And me, as the most conscious raincoat killer, uh, I was able to make my way here to see what, in fact, is going on. They're just up here having a good time. Having a laugh. They're not even wearing masks. Oh! Oh! Well, that explains it. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. I should have gotten that hint earlier. Oh! Oh, we were actually York envisioning as the raincoat killer, so we could see what's going on around here. Daddy, mommy, and grandpa, everyone's everyone's acting strange. strange. It's okay. We're gonna kill your parents. Oh no! Are we gonna have to kill him? You fucking assholes. You should have gotten a mask. We need to get inside the theater. Yeah, we should probably try to do that. Instead of just standing around and talking about it. So, can we just kill everybody, though? Maybe I want to kill everybody. So, it was doing the flashback. <laughs> they are currently being controlled by an unknown force. Let's try not to hurt them if we can. I did hurt them. <laughs> oh, it's going to be a game over because I became a bad guy and I killed them. <laughs> yeah, okay, well, we have to retry. Okay, I wanted to kill them though. Maybe I want to kill everybody. No? Okay, I get it. We can't kill everybody. I wanted to. Why can't we do that? Okay, we're gonna see what's happening now. Okay, we can't, be control. We can't go over there. You have to go around and avoid being killed by any of them. That's fine. And then we're gonna go in here and we might have to go to the other world again and I don't really wanna fucking do that. I mean, we've already fucking uncovered all the clues and profiled the events and we have stuff going on here. No, I'm not gonna shave. Y'all really want me to fucking shave, don't you? Let me see. What are we going do it can I change into anything? We can change back to this. Oh, this one has more health than this one? Huh. 
Well, I'm going to change because I like to change my clothes every so often. And let me see. Do I need any clothes that need to be cleaned? Do I have any clothes that need to be cleaned? No? Um, any... I don't think I have any weapons that I need. We can just Open proceed. This door. There is no turning back. You still want to enter? I don't really have a choice. Let's go. Very well. Off you go, Mr. York. Okay, we're gonna be good. So it's raining and then everybody get... Okay, if it rains... As often as it does. And finally you arrive, York. George is dead. You've got nowhere left to run. George! Oh, right, George. <laughs> he was a funny one. I gave him a toy locket. And he was so impressed. <laughs> so moved. <laughs> but... He wasn't very intelligent. He was born in this town, you see, and, and it took him too long to discover the Red Seeds. Binding down people's rules is a sign of small-mindedness, and that was what George represented in life. <laughs> I'm taking Emily. Oh, but I can't allow that now, can I? York, you left her to me. In my care, remember? I told you to come with us, didn't I? <laughs> Must remember that. But you didn't come. You chose your job over the woman that you love. Casey, this chit-chat is over. Oh! Indeed it is. My fun with Emily ended just a moment ago. It was a fantastic moment. <laughs> like eating a full course dinner that ends with the ultimate dessert. So are you saying that you raped her? I fed her a fake story about my past, and she took in every word. <laughs> Cut out your nonsense. I told you, no more talk. There you go, York. That's right. <laughs> Feel the hate boiling from the bottom of your stomach. 